Hi. Hi. Hello, everybody. Uh, happy fall for everybody. And today, me and Maya are making yeah. <laughs> uh, making a new fall decoration, which is going to be a fall garland. And uh, it's going to be right, rather naturally looking. So we bought this beautiful thread, yes, thread from string. Dollar Tree. We have these fall leaves from our other craft. Yes, yeah, so they're also from and Dollar Tree. And we have pine cones from our outside. Yes. So what I would like to do, would love to do, is to make the garland with both um, pine cones and real... Uh, red leaves and but we don't have them here we live in south california now and um, there is no fall leaves <laughs> so we're we're going to use the fake what ones. it's almost halloween yes and guys aren't you so excited for halloween because i am i'm like, the most thing i'm excited about is having a sugar rush tooth <laughs> So, uh, let's pick these all colors are Can quite open it? folly and beautiful, but which one do you think we should use? I would actually, I wanted to buy the burlap uh, color, like simple row, but they I lost them my finger. <laughs> so, let, uh, what are we gonna do? We are gonna... Uh, so that'll be just a little garland. We'll hang it um, on our window. Yeah. So I think to kind of make a pattern. Um, pine a pine cone and a leaf. Since the leaves are small, we might do several leaves. And then again, a pine cone, a leaf. A pine cone, a leaf. So that's going to make a nice pine pattern. pine cone leaves. Pine cone leaves. Yes, pine cone leaves, right. Okay, so let's see how can um, how we can attach a I have a pink can. A pine cone. Maybe if we just wrap it. Something like that. It's a bit dusty. Oh, and I can maybe even um I I I just think that hot gluing um pine cone might be difficult. Uh, so I'll just uh, tie it. Yeah, to my that's garland. probably a better idea. Yeah, so. Uh -huh. I like it. Like it? Uh -huh. Okay, so the next step is to put some leaves, which we have dozens. Nice. <laughs> um, leaves, leaves. Somewhere here. We need a hot glue gun, right? Here. Let me see. Uh, oops, I'll try the first Is one. it hot? No, my, it's a cold glue gun, actually. Cold glue gun. Okay. I'm going to attach this one. Okay, go on. Oops. Oopsies. May I have the stick, please? <laughs> touch, touch, touch. Okay. And we can maybe make several leaves. So we actually put some plastic because yeah. so, it was sticking to the yeah, paper. Yes, so that it's easier to unstick. So now let's I'll put some hot, hot glue, glue right here. The hot glue girl. Mm. Okay. That's not Okay. Um, <laughs> it just takes some time to yeah. dry. I guess we have to yeah. l l let it dry what a little bit. What I think bit, would look right? cute is maybe like... Put a leaf here like this, and a leaf like this, and then a leaf like here. Yeah, okay. You want one more? Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Okay, so one more here. Yep. And I ha I guess we have to just let it be in the air a little bit. Maybe our pine cone could help like this to dry it a little bit. Yeah. You know, we may fasten the process a little bit. I made this with hot glue. Oh, cool. With this little fan. Don't fan everything from the table, please. <laughs> okay, so our leaf is uh, nicely dried. 
So let's attach another pine cone. A leaf dropped. Okay, let's uh, make sure they're in similar positions, similar length. And let's try to attach it. Okay, something like that. So we finished. Yeah, so I kind of evaluated how much, how big is our window, so it will hang in our window. So let's hang it. Yeah. Like it. So this is a really simple and fun craft. If you want uh, to use real leaves, like maple leaves, you have to use Mod Pot. You can buy it in any craft store, even in Walmart. Uh, this is the um, uh, material you have to cover it like with glue and it will protect them from swirling and um, uh, wrinkling. So, it's going to be here, right? Okay, and look also Maya, while I'm hanging this, uh, we still have these leaves, some of them left. What do you think if we just spread them on the windowsill and some on the table to make it like the whole uh, for I like just put them yeah, here. and uh, we have also our wreath which we did last time. You can see the link to how to do this. So let's do it. Oh, I am just going to. Okay, so you are artistically spreading the leaves, pretending they just fell, right? Since it's fall, well, don't look at our green yard. We live in California. It's uh, there is no fall so far. Look over there. Yeah, Maya wants to show that we are actually on the 3rd of, uh, or whatever, 5th probably, is the day of October. We are just started uh, sprouting our peas, since it's so sunny here. So it's all done. Ta-da! I think it's pretty and it matches our our wreath since it was made from the same materials, right? Here you go. It's really easy, a nice fall and it's cheap. We spent uh, one dollar on the leaves and one dollar on the rope which we still have leftovers and, these were free and used for other crafts. And these were free because we found them outside. Yeah, we found them outside and uh, there's also leaves, leaves on the window seal. Mm -hmm. So thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you guys on our next episode. Bye! Bye! And from me, <laughs> um, yeah, thanks for watching. Here you can see the video of how to make this beautiful wreath as well. And uh, next time we're going to make a Halloween bouquet. Ooh! Mm -hmm. Ooh. Happy fall! Bye! Bye.